Welcome back to another episode of the Luxury Home Show with Tom and Jazz. Today you're joining us in Newton Garden Village, which is a development site by Redrow near Nottingham. We're going to be taking you inside this new build home behind me there. It's a four bed, three bath and just over 2,000 square feet. It's part of Red Rose Christmas Design Trends campaign and as we make our way through the house, we really hope you guys get some inspiration for Christmas. It was dressed by Red Rose interior designer, Alicia Ali. So make sure you keep an eye out for some awesome tips. But yeah, we're gonna head on to the front of the property now. Just before we start, make sure you check out Red Rose details down below in the description. But yeah, follow me. Here we are at the front of the property. You can see we've got a double garage to my right. And if I lift this up a bit, we've got a gorgeous Christmas wreath on the door to start off the Christmas trends. So Tom, are you ready to head on inside? Let's do it. Let's go. We're inside now. We're gonna take a quick moment to pop the floor plan up for you guys. We know you love them. So you can all understand the layout of the house a bit better. We've got the porcelainosa floor in the kind of natural plank tiles lights above so it's very bright in here we've got these stairs here leading up to the first floor and i can take a little peek at the christmas decorations in the kitchen behind where tom is but i'm going to take you into this lounge first now like i said in the intro we've got the christmas themes in this house and the first one is a woodland theme so in here the aim of this room was to really bring the outdoors inside and you can see that for all the natural motifs throughout we've got the garland here even with the animals we've got discrete animals like the owls here reindeers on the tree and yeah we've got these nice kind of bright colors too that really inspire that christmas optimism for the celebratory season and we've even got the addition of fabric like felt which really mimic the textures you do find outside and make it feel really yeah. homey and cozy in here and with the homey and cozy, we've got the fireplace. Yeah, it always helps in those winter months. Definitely. <laughs> and then we've got the windows here, bringing in so much natural light. Yeah. Looks great, doesn't it? It does, like a drawing room. Yeah, they've got all the ball balls, just the sparkles. Yeah, and that light is insane. Yes, it is gorgeous. <laughs> that is good light. Creates some really cool shadows, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. Okay, but Tom, I'm gonna take you across. First, it's worth noting in here, we've got downstairs WC powder room for your guests. Yeah, Andy, and some see the decorations storage. already. <laughs> <laughs> Come on in. <laughs> so the theme in this room is kind of that traditional Christmas with a modern twist, and you can really see that throughout. Now here we kind of have the spread on the table. Ah, look how yummy it looks. We've got <laughs> all the tasty, Christmas right? treats. You can see the traditional Christmas items, such as the gingerbread man. I'll have a the cookie. The mistletoes. Oh, do you want a cookie? Yeah. There you go. Cheers. <laughs> the candles, all of that. And yeah, you can see the modern twist with it, with kind of the dull metallics, sparkly baubles as well. And yeah, so many sweet treats. I really want one right now. I've got the wreaths behind you as well on the window. Yep, on the window, very nicely placed up yeah. there. I love the gingerbread house. The gingerbread house is really cool. And if you look through here, Tom, we actually have... Oh yeah. Freshly made gingerbread man. Freshly made gingerbread man. In the Siemens appliances. But yeah, this spread looks awesome. The kind of idea of a spread like this is to unify the theme of the whole room and just enhance it. Yeah. Oop, I love it. But the kitchen itself is also very well equipped. So we have a large kitchen island. There's loads of space between the counters here and that kitchen island, which is, you know, something you don't usually see. We've got the kind of quartz countertops, nice hand painted cabinets. Siemens appliances, fridge, freezer, loads of storage. It's really nicely equipped. Behind Tom, we have this lounge space, more for informal, I should say. It's worth noting that this kitchen is kind of separated into three. So we've got the dining room at that end, kitchen here, and the lounge space. Here we've got a nice L-shaped couch in the corner, some more darker tones in this room with the shelving. We've got the TV there along with the shelves beneath it too. And we've got the bifold doors leading out to a patio area in your garden, which also has some seating. Yeah. Yeah, very nice snug room this. Yeah, definitely. Like you said, a little bit more informal. Sit down, watch TV yeah, in there. Maybe eat your breakfast and stuff as well, yeah. Yeah. Great setup. 
But in here, we have the dining room with another theme. So we kind of have this snowy white theme in here. We've got the eucalyptus on the table with the white mistletoe, the icicles hanging from like the painted twigs, mm. even the plate setups. We've got the sparkly baubles, the kind of blues, the whites, the silvers. Very frosty. Frosty, like yeah, A winter exactly. wonderland. Yeah, and then we've got the tree here, which is frosted too presents underneath. We've also got the addition of that kind of natural element in here too, with the handcrafted Christmas decorations. We've got the mistletoe and the eucalyptus on the tree too. Yeah. Fits very well in this room. It matches the photo, the paintings behind me, I should say. We even got kind of that frosted glass. On the mirror, yeah. Yeah, and the darker tones throughout. Do you know what? This is for us. This is for us. Two Tom and Jazz. Oh, go on, Red. Oh my gosh. Thanks for visiting. Thanks for having us, Red. Thanks for having us. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, great room. And then, yeah. And then through here, we actually have a nice size utility room with the Siemens washing machine, dryer, loads of space, and yeah, more storage around too. Yeah. Great. I like the colour theme in here. They've got that nice base colour. So in there, it's that pink, and here it's the yeah. darker. In the kitchen, it's lighter. And it works really well together. Yeah, Red Row have their own interior design team. So, you know, they, they really follow trends. Yeah, exactly. And they've done such an amazing job in here. But yeah. Tom, do you want to take us upstairs? Yeah, I'll show you the bedrooms. Yep. Let's go. I'm going to take you into the first bedroom upstairs. So if you come in here with me, I've got a great size bedroom in here, some real earth tones sort of sandy colours and we've got the wood textured it's like a textured wood style wallpaper yeah looks it great looks cool. matches these bedside tables very oaky feel we have the bespoke desk set up here with all of this cabinetry around painted in white looks great good spot for a study right and then we've got a great seat in here nice little recess with your bay window so you can have a nice little view out yeah i like that that's cool right so now we're going to head straight across the hallway Ooh. Checking out this great chandelier in this yeah. landing area. So we come in here, all of the greens, they look incredible. The light above the bed, yeah. it's so stunning. Bay windows towards this side of the room as well. Loads of natural light coming in. Bespoke headboard, looks awesome. And these sort of splashes of green that you see in the pillows, even in the, the marble style. Lamps. Yeah, lamps, they look great. And we've got a humongous circular mirror here on your dressing table. Oh yeah. Great spot to sit in. And get ready. The dressing table and the bedside tables as well are in that nice smoked elm. Very good colour palette in here, Definitely. nice and grey, sort of matches the carpet too. We've got a dressing room in here, both sides as well, so enough for two people in here. And then we have the bathroom through here. Great ambient lighting above and below the mirror. Oh, yeah. The electronic. Yeah, cool, right? Yeah. Got the marble half tiles all the way up here, porcelainosa tiles throughout the bathrooms. Um, this one's in a Rivoli white, looks nice. Yeah. We've got the electronic shower behind here as well. We've got the overhead waterfall jet and then just the standard jet as well. I like that little step up there. Step up for your, your towel warmer, yeah. Yeah, great size bathroom. Twin sinks as well, some white gloss wall units. So now it's time for our next bedroom. So we're gonna turn right straight out of this room to the other side of the landing. Stairs do look great, don't they? They the, do. I the oak love it. Banisters. When, I love it when they're central. Okay, so we do have a bathroom here, which actually has the full length tiles in here, so no half tiles, and the white gloss wall unit as well. We've got a bath in here too, which Ooh, looks nice. great. Now we've got a kids' bedroom in here. I like this setup. We've got the polka dot wallpaper that side, it's looking good. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I'd have this bedroom. I don't know about kids' bedroom. <laughs> the cameras either side. They look cool too. Some butterflies. Yeah, the interior design, they always nail it. Yeah. I love this hat, check this out. Oh, I'd it's actually- It's like Jamiroquai. <laughs> I'd actually wear that. <laughs> it's quite cool, isn't it? Anyway, put that back. But yeah, this is a great book too. Read this if you want to be Instagram famous. Oh yeah. <laughs> so if you're reading this, go and follow the Luxury Home Show Instagram to see some behind the scenes. Yeah. Okay, heading back out of this room then. And Jazz is backing up now into the last bedroom. Now, this is one of my favorite bedrooms. I see this as a real watery theme. We've got the watercolor paintings on the wall, yeah. splashes of blue everywhere. We've got the bedside tables and these chest of drawers in the indigo. It looks really nice I with all these that. different colors of blue. Yeah, the, the, the surround of this 
cupboard as well is in that indigo, but we've got some sort of metal splashes as well, which really adds to that kind of watery theme. And the mirrors are tinted as well. And they are slightly tinted, that's a good observation. I didn't actually realise, yeah. but yeah, keeps it nice and mellow. And this light is incredible too, it's like bubbles, yeah. almost like little water droplets as well. So as I say, yeah, a real water themed bedroom this. But now we're gonna head through into the bathroom. We've got the half tiles as well in here. All porcelain oats are again, this time in that Dover Acero light, a slight gray tint to it, looks great. We've got the charcoal wall mounted unit as well, which adds a bit of a contrast to that sink. And we've got another mirror light, this Ooh. one with storage though. So yeah, loads yeah. of storage in there. And then we've got the shower behind the screen in here, sliding door. Oh, nice. Yeah. Good use of space that. Yeah, definitely. Let's head back out into this landing. And just get one last look at this staircase because it looks great. I hope you guys have enjoyed this tour of the Red Row home. Hope you've been inspired by all the Christmas decorations you've seen as well. If you'd like more information on that, hit up Red Row in the description of this video. The links will be there so you guys can check that out to get even more inspired this Christmas. I hope you guys have enjoyed this tour. Make sure to like and subscribe. Leave down in the comments below your favorite room that you've seen upstairs and the favorite room downstairs in terms of Christmas decorations, which one you prefer the most. But yeah, like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.